everybody. My name is Ricky Smith. Welcome to Faith on Friday. If your memory is anything like mine, then it's probably a little sketchy and sometimes unreliable. Does this sound familiar? You have one item to buy at the store. So you go to the store and wander around for 45 or 50 minutes. You finally make your purchase, leaving with such a great sense of accomplishment. And you get home and then remember, it wasn't a flat screen TV that you went to get. It was peanut butter. If I asked you right now, where do you keep your brilliant ideas? What would you say? In your head? On your phone? On a napkin in your pocket? or on a post-it note that you can't seem to find right now. And what about those brilliant ideas? Can you remember them in detail right this second? Or do you have a goal or a task to try to accomplish? Can you refer to it? Can you share it with anyone else? When you have ideas or goals to accomplish, it may not be as wise as you think to rely on that sketchy memory. You may want to start writing them down. But what does writing anything down actually do? Writing things down develops clarity and focus. It gives you direction and a path to follow. It keeps you on track and keeps you from wandering off. Writing things down clears your head and makes room for the details. It helps better organize your thought. Writing things down keeps you accountable and continues to inspire you. When you write things down, it brings your ideas to life, making them real. So the next time you have a brilliant idea, a goal, or even a shopping list, don't rely on your unreliable memory. Write them down instead so you can refer back to it, share it with someone else as well. You never know, that could change everything. Thank you everybody for watching and thank you so much for sharing the video. Hey, don't forget while you're here, subscribe to our YouTube channel, give us a thumbs up and leave us a comment. Where do you keep your brilliant ideas? My name is Ricky Smith and I'll see you next Friday.